Good afternoon, everyone. This is Christy with Van Auto Company. It's Thursday, August 22nd. I'm going to go over the markets with you for the day. Uh, very slight positive close into the cord market. Traded both sides of today uh, and really just very quiet. News out there, not a whole lot. Soybeans down over four cents, which was a little bit surprising as we had great export sales this morning for soybeans. And Pro Farmer continues to find low pod counts when you look at the crop tour as a whole across the board. And USA really has not decreased yield like they have to the degree you have seen in corn. And so you'd think that would be friendly enough, but finding some struggling there, uh, like I said, down four and a half cents. Minneapolis wheat was down four and a half cents as well. That was disappointing, Had could be due to farmer selling, could be pressure from the fact that harvest is continuing to um, kind of move along. Uh, Chicago wheat and uh, Kansas City both traded both sides of today. So overall, just a lot of mixed trade with a lack of direction as there's just no new news out there. Meat markets, both, um, Live cattle and feeder cattle had some light support, almost a buck higher. Uh, and then when you look at uh, lean hogs, down a buck on the day. So mixed trade is that as well there. You can definitely tell it is a Thursday today, kind of in the middle, trying to get to the end of the week, trying to find some sort of new information. Tonight, we will get Pro Farmers Yield for Minnesota and Iowa. And then on Friday, after the close, we will get Pro Farmers Total Yield for the U.S. And we'll be seeing how that relates to USDA's main number. Uh, outside markets, very quiet as well. So just really a lack of news today. I do have to close with the disclaimer. Trading futures and options involves risk loss and is not suitable for all producers. This is the solicitation. Have a great day.